Hey, welcome back to my channel. Um, you're gonna hear some kid noises possibly today. I have my two nieces here, and so I've got five kids here and they're out in the dining room. But I'm gonna do this haul for you guys really quick. And so a little backstory. My teenage son, who is 13, has been asking and asking for a dog. And we live in a small house and we live in town and I kept telling him no and no and like, you know, anyhow. So my husband sent me a picture one day of a puppy that he had been inquiring about and yeah, it's a golden retriever. So we drove or I drove close to four hours one way and picked up this puppy and my middle son went with us, went with me and came back and we pulled off the surprise for my 13 year old son and presented him with this eight week old golden retriever puppy. So yes, and he said, I didn't think you would give it to just me. He thought it would be for all three of the boys. So it made it extra special that this puppy is just for him. So now we have a new addition to our family and his name is Shadow. So anyhow, so a side note, I have been on dog duty at night. I'm the one who gets up and takes him out and let my son sleep, but he has been doing the dog duty during the day. Anyhow, okay, so on my way home from picking up this puppy, there was a thrift store, like just literally right off the road. So I pulled in and I was able to park up close to the front. So my middle boy just sat out in the car with the puppy while I ran in. And you guys, I found basically almost a collection of this Falls Graph china set that i already have uh several pieces to i have the canisters and let's see a platter the creamer and sugar i have the gravy boat so let's get started on this okay these were 3.99 a piece okay and i got Let's see here. Three. That's kind of an odd number. Seven. It seems like it should be. So there's four of them. There's two more. You guys look at how like simple these are, but yet the te the the lines to it give it like a cozy textured look. Aren't those so? plain but yet pretty so i'm seeing seven i thought there would be an even number but i guess not three four five six seven so seven of seven of the coffee mugs or would these be teacups not sure and you guys <coughs> this is the falls graft that has the stamp in it not just like the print. I know you can get some false graph that's like the black printed, which I'm thinking is more newer. So this is the one with like the stamp on the bottom. Okay. Seven coffee cups, $3.99. But every, this was all half off. Okay. All right. This is the piece I am most excited about that I got that goes to this collection. You guys. Look, the salt and pepper shakers, $5.99 a piece, but half off. Okay, so like $3 for unique salt and pepper shakers. It does look like somebody had to replace out the bottoms, which is so ugly, but you're not gonna see it. Look at these, and they're nice size too. So I now have the salt and pepper shakers to my false graph china and it's just got clean lines but yet it's got enough uh enough going on that it's cozy not too plain 
this casserole bowl. Look at this. This was $14.99. Oops. But again, it was half off. So what? $7.50 for a, oh, I forgot. This is part of this haul too. Hold on. I'm going to show you this. Okay. There's the inside of the casserole dish. And again, it's got the Falls Graph stamp. Would that be called a stamp? If you guys know what that's called, let me know. It's like an imprint into the actual bowl. Like up against woods. Okay, so I got the, this This is the smaller casserole dish to this Falls Graph. China set, okay. And then there was the bigger one, okay. Woo, $24.99, again, half off. So I'll show you guys the size comparison. So look. So the bigger one and the smaller one. And the bigger one, that does seem pricey, $24.99, but it was half off. And it's so big and su substantial for decorating. Look at this, you guys. Isn't that beautiful? And this one is in excellent condition. Yes. And I can always add um, color to this, like put it on, on, on a plaid tablecloth or, yeah. And again, you guys, these lines keep it from being too boring and too plain. Okay. Okay. And then I got to that, the big falls graph platter. Okay. This thing is very nice size. Like that's well, let's see. That's my arm. And this one was $19.99. Now this one has a, a more clearer stamp. Like you're able to read it better. So, and it's got two dash 17 on it, but again, half off of $19.99, okay. I mean, so many uses for this. It could be in the middle of my farmhouse table with, um, I don't know, fruit on it, or if you guys have any ideas, of course I could always hang it or use it for layering, okay. Uh, if, I wanted to, if I wanted to have some fun and use it as a bed tray, like with a vase of flowers, a book, and um, maybe like some little mint scattered or something. Yeah, nice size platter. And little side note, I'm hoping, Lord willing, to get to that surprise project that I have been telling you guys about. Excuse my hair. I did not take the time to curl it today, so for you guys. So it's um, frizzy. Okay, the smaller platter. So he's much smaller. Look at the look at the size comparison. Okay, both platters. And I have a false graph platter, but I, I don't believe it's any of these sizes. So now I'm, it looks as if I have the large, the medium and the small. So imagine all of those layered together, okay? Yeah. And maybe with just like a hint of a colored piece of china here. Like my, uh, oop, my front door just came open and it's cold. Okay, so imagine all these whites with just like a little hint of some colored china to give it, uh, to keep it from being too boring and uh, yeah. Okay, this I had picked up just the other day at a, the, the junkie thrift store. So this was not from uh, that St. Vincent de Paul thrift store. This is Johnson Brothers made in England. 
Do you guys hear the puppy? He's, he's about nine weeks old. So he is, yeah, in his prime of being a puppy. Okay, this was $4.99, um, 30% off, I think. But this is beautiful, beautiful, nice. Um, I could set this on so many places. My buffet, out in the dining room. Or you know what? I can even actually just use it, okay? That's another thing is life is so short, so use your stuff. And when it's when it breaks or when it's used up, then it's done and you know you used it and enjoyed it. So I might actually put this in my kitchen and use this. The kids would enjoy that. Okay, so that is my quick all white thrift haul. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I can't title it all white because I did grab this little guy. Okay. Isn't he beautiful? And he is called his, let's see, historic castles. And it's, this is made in England. But again, like what I was saying, imagine a bunch of whites going on with a little hint of some color, okay? Yeah. So he was two, he was 259 half off. So I can just throw him in somewhere. Yeah. He's got the Lud, Ludlow Castle. There we go. Thank you guys for being here for this rather quick thrift haul and going along with me and seeing us pick up Shadow, the new addition to our home. And stay tuned for more upcoming videos and thank you for being here as I create Cottage Diaries.